Hi, welcome to the final video of this emergency preparedness series. Tonight we're going to be talking about a tsunami and what to do if you're caught in a tsunami. First of all, tsunamis are caused by earthquakes in the ocean. And so if you're experiencing an earthquake, the first thing you want to do is deal with the earthquake. And then secondly, you want to deal with the tsunami warnings. If you are in a tsunami, the first thing that you want to do is go as far inland as possible. Get away from the water. You don't want to be anywhere near it. You want to be like running, probably driving as fast as you can towards land. I mean, obviously you're on land, but inland, if you're out, out at the coast, drive in as far as possible. Secondly, if you are in water when a tsunami hits, like if you get caught up in the water, um, and this could apply for a flood too, you want to grab onto something that floats like a door or a tree trunk, something like that, and hang on to it to keep your head above water so you can keep breathing. And then hopefully someone will come rescue you or when it's safe to do so, you can swim out. And then third and final tip for if you are in a tsunami, if you're in the water, but like on a boat, hold on to the boat, but in the boat, you want to head out towards the sea and that's going to um, help protect you from the tsunami. And hopefully we won't ever have to experience that, but... I know they've had quite a few in Japan and Indonesia and have had um, their fair share of tsunamis. So if you've ever traveled, that's, these are all great things to know. Be sure if you haven't already to check out the rest of the videos in this series so that you know what to do during an emergency, no matter where you're at, no matter what kind of emergency that hits. And um, please be sure to subscribe also to learn more about adapting um, fitness and exercises to fit your needs. Thank you, have a great night.